everyone, welcome back to Better Biomed. Today we're going to talk about the International Biomed Association. It's something that we mentioned in a previous video, but today it's, it's a reality. And it's something that we are going to give you a link and we're going to allow you guys to sign up. And that way there you can be part of a much larger community. And joining me is Bill Basuk. He's going to explain what the community is about and uh, how you can become a member. All right. Thank you so much for having me. So my name is Bill Basick, and the International Biomedical Association of Education is about uniting all the biomedical associations, not only throughout the country, but internationally as well, so we can collaborate more collectively as a unified team in the medical industry. And the purpose for this is we have associations throughout the country, and they all have their purpose, is to get them all under the same association, still being independent to each other and to themselves, wherever their location is. but what we're trying to tackle are some of the bigger issues like the right to repair. So recently we've been working with a lot of organizations to do that. And there's a lot of new areas that are trying to start organizations up. So we're assisting them and helping them to do that as well. But the good news is, is that we spoke with the CEO of the DNV on the right to repair, and they're hundred percent on board to be able to mediate once we get the OEMs together and the ISOs. And I say that plural, but it doesn't necessarily have to be. It could start with one ISO, one OEM, where they come together, collaborate, set up standards that the DNV will mediate on. Once it's mediated, the DNV will issue a set of these standards. And for an ISO to work on the OEM's equipment, we'll have to have um, the certification from the DNV. And that's a pretty good way to have a happy medium between the ISOs and the OEMs to make sure that the companies working on their equipment are vetted properly. So that's one of the reasons for developing this association is to get more awareness globally, not just nationally. The other reason for this uh, association is the benefits of the independent associations throughout the country to join us will be we will offer one scholarship to each association of their choice for the College of Biomedical Equipment Technology on a certificate level. So that's our way of giving back to the industry through education. And that costs you nothing. Membership is free. What we hope to do is uh, obtain about 1,000 members within the next uh, three months. And from there, we'll be able to get sponsorship fairly easy. So this is an international biomed association. If you belong to an existing association here in the United States, they call them all different things. HTMAs, there's, there's what, CT something. Yeah. I mean, there's, there's a bunch of different names that they go by here in the United States. That's okay. If you belong to one of those organizations, we, we truly believe that a local voice is, is a powerful thing. However, on a national scale, we can be a collective. I mean, you can have a wider representation and we all, as biomeds, we want to solve problems. That's the main thing that we want exactly. to do. We can solve bigger problems together. We're going to have it so that we can do group training. We can do group events where you can log in, answer questions from people around the world. It's a much bigger mission than what you currently are serving. And that's the real goal of this is to bring us together as a collective and make a bigger impact on this entire world. That's absolutely correct. All right, guys. Well, I'm going to leave the link in the video description down below. The website is active. We're already enrolling people and it's been good. But we're looking, if you guys belong to an existing Biomed Association in the United States, you can actually recommend, please do, that your association be part of this. And that's, yeah. that's what we want. We want to bring them all under one umbrella to have a bigger voice. So guys, look down below. We'll give you more information. And if you have any questions, ask them down below. I'll see if I can answer them. And if anything, we'll do a supplemental video with Bill. And uh, we'll, we'll see if we can answer your questions for follow-up. Thank you. All right. Thanks, guys.